Ceramic petrography in the late Bronze Age Aegean represents a confluence of art, science and history, offering insights into the socio-economic underpinnings of ancient civilizations. The Aegean region during this period was a crucible of cultural and economic activity, with ceramics playing a pivotal role in the narrative of commerce and cultural diffusion. The meticulous study of ceramics through petrographic analysis involves examining thin sections of pottery under a polarizing microscope. This allows for the identification of mineralogical compositions, which are crucial for sourcing the clay used in the pottery. By determining the origins of the clay, researchers can trace the movement of goods and infer trade routes. For instance, the presence of specific minerals like quartz, feldspar and mica, along with their grain size, shape and distribution within the ceramic matrix, provides clues about the geographical origin of the pottery. This period saw a significant evolution in ceramic technology, with the advent of the potter's wheel and new firing techniques leading to more uniform and durable products. The standardization of certain pottery types, especially amphorae, which were used for storing and transporting goods such as oil, wine and grains, indicates a level of sophistication in production that catered to the demands of a burgeoning trade economy. The trade of ceramics was not merely a matter of economic transaction, but also a medium for cultural exchange. The spread of Mycenaean pottery, characterized by its distinctive shapes and decorative motifs across regions such as Cyprus, the Levant and Egypt, illustrates the cultural influence exerted by the Mycenaeans. This diffusion of pottery styles also facilitated the transmission of artistic techniques and motifs, contributing to a shared aesthetic and technological vocabulary in the region. Moreover, the role of ceramics in the late Bronze Age extends beyond functional wear. The presence of finely decorated pottery in burial contexts, especially in elite tombs, underscores its role in social and ritual practices. The exchange of such luxury items was likely a display of wealth and power, further entwining the economic and social fabric of these societies. The collapse of the Bronze Age civilizations around 1100 BCE, marked by the destruction of palatial centers and disruption of trade networks, is reflected in the archaeological ceramic record. The sudden decrease in the distribution of Mycenaean pottery and the appearance of new ceramic styles suggest a profound socio-political shift likely resulting from a combination of factors including natural disasters, invasions, and internal decline. In the realm of ceramic compositional analysis, the intricate details of elemental and mineralogical composition gleaned from techniques such as X-ray fluorescence, XRF, neutron activation analysis, NAA, and inductively coupled plasma mass spectrometry, ICPMS, offer a profound level of insight. For instance, the trace element signatures identified through these methods allow for the distinction between local and non-local pottery, thereby mapping out trade networks with remarkable precision. The isotopic ratios, particularly of strontium and neodymium, serve as geochemical fingerprints, linking ceramics to specific clay sources, often pinpointing the geological provenance with astonishing accuracy. Furthermore, the examination of slip and paint composition on ceramics particularly the use of rare pigments or unique tempering materials, can indicate specialized production centers and trade routes specific to certain luxury wares. This level of detail extends to the study of kiln technology, with variations in firing atmospheres and temperatures discernible through the examination of vitrification levels and crystalline structures within the ceramic matrix. Such detailed analyses not only map the physical movement of goods, but also suggest the transfer of technological knowledge as potters in different regions adopted and adapted new methods and styles, indicative of a dynamic interconnected web of artisanal knowledge exchange. The study of ceramic petrography and commodity exchange in the late Bronze Age Aegean is a testament to the interconnectedness of ancient societies. It reveals a complex network of trade and cultural exchange, driven by advancements in ceramic technology and the demands of a dynamic economic system. This intricate web of interactions laid the foundations for subsequent cultural developments in the Mediterranean and beyond, highlighting the enduring impact of these ancient societies on the course of human history.